Hey guys, what's up? Today I want to talk to you briefly about how ChatGPT is going Super Saiyan 3 and how you can take advantage of it. The reason I say ChatGPT is going Super Saiyan 3 is because they're using a form that is completely unsustainable. It's um, overweight and there's an opportunity here for you to take advantage of it and I think you should. I am taking advantage of it um, now that I've seen it come through and I'm going to be using it to do a lot of heavy lifting. Now, we're going to talk briefly about how to take advantage of these growth focused tech companies. Now, there are a lot of other tech companies that have been also super growth focused, right? Um, and when I say growth focused, it means that they're working in a way that they're not even really profitable. They're burning money. Um, and this is because their valuations are based on users and user check-ins and you know how many times a user uses their product a day and so it's not about how valuable the product is it's about how the market sees you know user growth and that's how valuations happen that's how ceos get their payouts famous companies that have done this include uber which i think is still running at a loss um, amazon in its early years which is now actually like in some kind of decline we can go into that later if that's business stuff that you're interested in and Netflix, which started off burning money. Um, WeWork, DoorDash, still losing money. Spotify, the free tier loses money. Snapchat. I mean, a lot of these companies were like that. So just to cut down to the basic of it, what I'm going to tell you about is the new ChatGPT, the Codex. Now, the Codex is using a form of the LLM, which is not quantized, which means it's not minimalized. It's not in a cost saving route. Now, Claude is using this in its Claude code. It's using a budgetary version of this. You get kind of a portion of what is most valuable, right? So the LLM in its peak form, right? The LLM in like World War Hulk status. That's not what you're getting in Claude code. What you're getting is like, you know, I don't know, like just a plain Super Saiyan version, you know what I mean? Like just one level up, powerful enough, but also cost effective so they can kind of like show people that their margins are pretty solid. Now, I wanna to talk to you briefly about, you know, just how to take advantage of these growth tech companies. So what's gonna happen and what you're gonna see is, what we're seeing now is that Codex is being released, okay? Codex is not quantized which means it's not being like hampered or cut down in any way. Whereas um, Claude code is quantized, which means that you're getting a, a delayed or shortened version of itself. Now, for now, uh, Claude codes found that it's been able to eat the lunch of ChatGPT, right? And Codex is ChatGPT. So what we wanna do is while Codex is in this like extremely strenuous form where it's going to burn a lot of money, we're going to use that to kind of get a bunch of our projects done for cheap. You can sign up for Codex for 20 bucks. Um, the odd code right now, depending on which version you're using, is up to 200, which means you can save upwards of 180 bucks uh, just by switching to Claude code. I wouldn't switch it for everything. I would probably go um, normal Claude for 20 and normal Codex, which is what a lot of uh, the people who I listen to are also doing, uh, people who work in this space. And for any coding stuff, I'm switching over to Claude Code. I'm going to get a bunch of stuff done with that while it's cheap and while it's in this like Super Saiyan 3 form, right? So let's take advantage of it, switch over, drop the 20 bucks, pause your Claude Code subscription, drop it from, I'm going to drop mine from the 200 down to the 20 when it comes up on the 3rd here on October 3rd. And I'm going to get as much done in the meantime as I can. What's going to happen is after Codex acquires enough users and it looks good and it can do a quarterly report of user growth, X, Y, Z, whatever, it's probably going to switch back to a, a worse version. And in the meantime, Claude Code should be releasing another one as well, where it will be able to compete more effectively with the Codex because Claude Code is about to see a bunch of its users jump ship uh, and go over to ChatGPT, and that's not good for its stockholders or shareholders. So the shareholders are going to be saying, hey, what are you going to do to get us back there and get, you know, get these users back? And it's, you know, they're probably having a lot of meetings right now about 
what they think ChatGPT is going to do next and how they can compete. So, but in the meantime, when it comes to you and saving money and making money, um, the Codex is going to be a super optimized version. Okay. It's going to be, it's not a sustainable version, right? It's not going to last forever. Uh, it's going to burn out. It's, it's heavy. It's doing a lot of work and it's not going to be like that forever. But in the meantime, you can take advantage of it. So anyways, that's it today. I just want to do this quick update. I'm really, you know, do what you need to do for you. But in terms of getting a lot of work done for cheap, this $20 version is going to save you a lot of money. It's going to get a lot of great work done. I'm going to run some tests over here on the channel. If you're interested, hit the like button, subscribe, hang out, uh, watch this video if you're interested in other stuff like this and watch and subscribe right here. I'd be happy to hang out with you as much as you want. See you later.